Dangerous invasive plant species have been spotted all over Gahnawage and could be in your backyard. The Environment Protection Office is doing an awareness campaign and KTV caught up with Kipo summer students who explained what these plants look like. The Gahnawage Environment Protection Office is doing an awareness campaign about several invasive species. Uh, we're looking at the phragmites, the wild parsnip, Japanese knotweed uh, and buckthorn. Uh, several of these species are found around the community, such as the Japanese knotweed is found here on uh, the island and is around the radio station. The others grow just about everywhere. And so we're asking any homeowners to uh, contact us if they have these plants in their, their homes and we can provide them with more information about removal. So if you're looking to remove some of the invasive plants in your own yard, make sure to always be prepared with your with your clothing, make sure that you're wearing the right clothes too and using the tools to remove them. Especially wild parsnip because they are uh, dangerous. If the sap gets on your skin, it could burn you, especially in the sun. So just to take some precautions there. If you have any questions regarding the plants in your yard, you can give us a call at the office, either myself, Louisa, Cole, or Patrick, and we'd be happy to help.